What's up, guys? Redbeard here from Bot and Cop. It's Thursday. AMD is probably going to drop. They do every Thursday at 9.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, so I don't see why today would be any different. So what we're going to do, first thing, we're going to go to CAPTCHAs, and you don't have to select anything. Um, I would recommend putting proxies here. And in each of these, you can create one of these two, three, four. It really just depends on how much you're comfortable with, how many captures you're solving, how many captures you're comfortable with solving at one time. Um, but you want to log into YouTube on each of these. You click here, log into YouTube, um, which is basically your Google account. But you want to use one click accounts. You don't have to have one click accounts, but it's going to be way more efficient if you do. Um, if you don't know what one click accounts are, Basically, the captures that pop up that you can click on, and it's just like one click on the little checkbox, and you're good. That means that your Gmail account, it looks like a real person, and Gmail recognizes you as a real person. That's what sites look at uh, to decide whether you're going to have to click a bunch of pictures or if you just get a one-click checkbox. Um, I know a lot of sneaker botters are familiar with that, but a lot of new retail botters specifically don't know what a one-click is, so just a quick breakdown. Um... AYCD uh, is a really good tool for training your Gmails to have one-click status. Anyway, that being said, um, I have several one-click accounts already. I usually do four of these. And then you want to go to your task. I have a million of them, so I'm going to sort by AMD. We are, I already have all mine set up, but I'm just going to create a brand new one to give you guys an example. I'm going to go with guest. Let's go with test. Um, monitor proxy, I'm going with Oculus Resis and check out for Oculus Resis. AMD Resis work best for AMD. You can go with ISP if you want to, but you're going to have way better luck with AMD. Um, for SKUs, you can get the SKU on the website or your cook group. Number three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. At Bot and Cop, we have them in our SKU section, um, but you can, you can get them from the website. They're literally right there. They're like in the link. You'll see them. It's the numbers. You get it. All right, for delay, anywhere from 1,000 to 3,000, um, I recommend mixing it up a bit and seeing what works best for you. 2222 two, two, two seems like a good one. We'll go with quantity of one. For CAPTCHA, blah, 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 blah. For CAPTCHA provider, we're going to go with solver. Skip checkout, skip out. Skip checkout CAPTCHA. We're going to leave that blank and we're not going to do anything for start time or end time. Um, for task, uh, if you want to, like, let's say that I selected five profiles there. If it has, if I see how it says one task, if I create, it's going to create one task for each of those profiles. If you do two tasks, then it's going to create two tasks for each profile, which would be 10. You want to be careful. Like you don't want to run too many tasks here, because if you do, you're going to be like overloaded with captures. You're not going to be able to solve them all. So, you know, you kind of, you need to know yourself, you need to know, uh, how fast you can solve cop ca captures. I can't talk today. Anyway, um, yeah, that's pretty much it as far as what you got to do to set up um, as far as what to do when the drop happens. So uh, usually like our monitors will ping whenever um, AMD is dropping, which is 955 every single time. When that happens, you want to um, get ready, right? <laughs> and you want to like open a browser, go to AMD, go to the queue, click on the link that the monitor popped up or whatever and go to the queue. Um, or if you're in a cook group, click on your cook groups. Ours will be in our AMD monitor or our GPU monitor. Or staff will probably ping it. And um, so you'll open it up, then you'll be in the queue on your browser and you watch it and just keep watching it. Don't start your task yet. You'll see this little man start walking across the screen. And when you see that, that means it's time to start the task. Like AMD is lying, okay? It says the queue starts in 15 minutes or whatever it says. The queue doesn't really start in 15 minutes. It, it does not start when that time runs out. It starts when you see the little man start walking across the screen. So that's when you want to start your task and start solving captures as fast as you freaking can. Um, another way to know when to start task, I believe Thermal typically announces it uh, when to start your task in uh, Stellar. Or your cook group should announce it as well. So, but to make sure that you are, that you're not depending on someone else, just watch. And when you see the little man walking, that's when you should start your task. Start solving caches as fast as possible. Get through, check out, win. Um, if you see a whole bunch of freaking errors and stuff, don't like try to delete your task and duplicate them and all that stuff. It's just, that's just how it is. Um, Restart the bot, start all your tasks over again. That's usually the best bet. 
Um, and yeah, that's just how it is. And I know a lot of people complain every week, oh, Stellar flopped AMD, blah, 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 blah. Well, Stellar's the only bot that even does AMD. Uh, so, <laughs> so, you know, you, uh, you got to take what you can get. So at least they have a module that, I mean, it does work. You know, it's not like uh, running Amazon where you just run it 24 seven, don't have to touch it. It does require um, some manual effort, but it works and it does cook. So that being said, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope this helped you out. Like, comment, subscribe. If you're looking for a cook group, link in the description below for Bot and Cop, and I will see you guys in the next one.